Hi guys, this is Alex, and this is episode number one of the Battle of the Song. Today I'm just gonna be going over, like, the trench. I'm just gonna be building the trench, and the, um, and I'm gonna show you the paper and stuff like that. So, I'm, the next mock we're gonna have is the Battle of the Somme. Now, I chose this mock because I've been reading a lot of books about Battle of the Somme. So, yeah, I would think I, that would be best to do. And so, there's going to be a main tr trench network for the Germans right here. Then there will be a few craters, about four. I'm thinking a few puddles, like some craters being puddles. Because, like, you know how in the Battle of the Somme they had a lot of problems. I may have a tank right here. I don't know yet. If it's going to be a tank, it's going to be light. And then I'm also going to have a supply line coming through. Okay, um, yeah. So, guys, basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to pretty much just do a um, straight trench because my... Um, my, um, I ha I don't have very much of these plates. Um, I have a lot of filler brick, though, so I might have to do some of that. But what I was going to do here is make a pretty straight trench, put a few, um, I put a few ladders in it, just some little details like that. And then over here... Like right here, I have this um, about the supply line, and the supply line right there, that's going to be opened up, probably with that like that, because the um, there's going to be some, um, it's, I'll go get it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do it like this, and I'm going to put it in between that like that. And it's gonna be like you can you could yeah it's it's sort of it's mini figure scale well at least it's a little mini figure scale I mean I should probably make it a little bit taller but yeah I just threw this together in a few seconds now the technique I'm going to be using for the trench is gonna be this this technique. So what the technique is, is you get a studded um, brick. It can be four long, it can be pretty much any length. And you, you would have it and you would stick it onto this. And then you would put it down like that and just cover everything up them so yeah i'm going to start making the trench so basically what i did is i've done the trench it took me about maybe <coughs> <coughs> took me about 10 minutes to do i just put a mini finger in there just for like scale wise it's so what I'm thinking of doing is I'm thinking of doing. Let's see, I'll just pause it. What I'm thinking is I would do like this, something like that, because it's sort of it would make the trench a little higher up, or I would just like, but not in like not in this order, more like um. More so it looks a little bit more like, um, like it's natural instead of just, like, stare. So, yeah. So, I'm going to start building the outside of the trench, okay? Hi, guys. And so, what I did is I put the first layer of the back on, and... I'm just going to um, 
finish that, but one of the problems I had was trying to get the, um, the plates on. But that, oh yeah, also I I just found a problem with this. I, my plan for that is probably going to cover it up like this. Like what I did with this side, sort of. Or just cover it up somehow. I mean, I don't really care. As I, I, I think it's, um, quality is better than port. Like, if you have a ginormous mock, but it barely has any details, I, it's, I, I think, I think quality is better than quantity. That, that's what I think. So I would, I would just finish that all up and just try to make it better. So guys, basically what I did is I 